hey hi everyone welcome back to automation elearn so guys many of you have requested me to come up with the videos on java programming related interview questions so from today i am going to start a new series on my youtube channel for the same where i will discuss different java programming interview related questions and different scenarios which will be very useful for the newcomers and as well as for the experienced people as well so in this video i have a small code snippet and we have to figure out what will be the output of the given code snippet so let me take you to my eclipse workspace and we'll go through the given program so guys here i have a main method and uh, i have a few lines of code so this is a very small code snippet that i have and we have to figure out what will be the output of this program so let me explain what we are doing here so we have initialized one string which has a value as a automation even and after that we are performing concat operation we are adding some string to the original string and uh, next we are calling to uppercase method and we are assigning it back to str which is this one and again i am performing replace operation where i am replacing word suresh in caps with suresh dube and at the end i am just printing str so this is the simple string operation we are doing and we have to figure out what will be the output of this program what will be the value of str at the end so guys i would request you to take a pause you can pause the video you can think about the solution and let me know in the comment section what will be the output according to you all right so let me run this program and see so run as java application so guys here we are getting automation elearn all in caps so looking at the output it seems we initialized one string variable and we performed concat operation but but looking at the output it seems concat operation did not work and it converted all the characters of str to uppercase and then again replace operation also did not work and uh, when we are printing it's printing the original str all in caps because here we called to uppercase method but why this concat operation and why replace operation did not work why it is not reflecting in the output so guys here we need to understand few concepts which are related to string in java which will help you guys to understand what exactly happens behind the scene when we ran this program so to explain all these concepts i have designed one diagram which will help you to visualize the the changes that is happening in the in the given str so here at the left hand side i have my code statements and at the right hand side we will see how my str value will get modified after each operation right here we are initializing one str variable of type string and it has a value automation elearn so what will happen is in the memory so though there are a lot many other concepts involved related to memory like heap memory stack memory but i don't want to mix all these things here so for the simplicity purpose let's consider it like okay one object will get created with the value automation elearn and there is one str variable reference variable which is pointing to that object and it has a value automation elearn in the next statement i am performing concat operation i am adding by suresh over here to original string so my object will get modified like this automation elearn by suresh so what will happen here is it will create a new object the original object str will remain as is it will not get modified and new object will be created by appending by suresh to original str automation elearn so my object value will now be automation elearn by suresh why it will create a new object because string is immutable once we define once we declare the string it cannot be modified further if we will try to perform any modification to the given string then new object will be created like this but after executing this still my str will point to the original object only why so because after performing concat operation i am not storing the output over here right we are not bothering about what will happen what changes will happen to str after concat operation so this is the change right but we are not storing it anywhere we are not assigning any reference variable so this is like a dangling object there will not be any reference variable pointing to this object so my str is still this one original value right 
नेक्स्ट वी आर परफॉर्मिंग टू अपर केस ऑपरेशन ऑन एस टी आर सो एस टी आर इज स्टिल पॉइंटिंग टू माई ओरिजिनल वैल्यू राइट सो अपर केस ऑपरेशन विल बी परफॉर्म ऑन दिस ऑब्जेक्ट सो विच विल टर्न ऑल माई कैरेक्टर्स इन टू कैप्स राइट सो ऑटोमेशन ई लर्न ऑल इन कैप्स सो न्यू ऑब्जेक्ट विल बी क्रिएटेड ओवर हियर विच हैज अ वैल्यू एज अ ऑटोमेशन ई लर्न ऑल इन कैप्स बट हियर वी आर स्टोरिंग द आउटपुट इन वन रेफरेंस वेरिएबल अगेन एस टी आर राइट इन द सेकेंड स्टेटमेंट वी वर नॉट कैप्चरिंग वी वर नॉट स्टोरिंग द आउटपुट बट हियर आफ्टर परफॉर्मिंग टू अपर केस ऑपरेशन आई एम स्टोरिंग द आउटपुट इन द सेम वेरिएबल एस टी आर ओनली सो हियर वॉट विल हैपन इज न्यू ऑब्जेक्ट गॉट क्रिएटेड बिकॉज वी परफॉर्म सम मॉडिफिकेशन टू द गिवेन स्ट्रिंग एंड वी आर स्टोरिंग दैट टू एस टी आर राइट सो वट विल हैपन हियर इज एस टी आर विल स्टार्ट पॉइंटिंग टू दिस ऑब्जेक्ट नाउ इट विल नॉट पॉइंट टू दिस वन सो दिस चेंज विल हैपन आफ्टर वी एग्जीक्यूट दिस स्टेटमेंट राइट सो नाउ वट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ एस टी आर इट इज ऑटोमेशन ई लर्न ऑल इन कैप्स सो एस टी आर इज नाउ पॉइंटिंग टू टू दिस ऑब्जेक्ट हियर एंड इट विल ब्रेक द रेफरेंस विथ ओरिजिनल ऑब्जेक्ट दैट वी क्रिएटेड इनिशियली राइट यूजिंग दिस स्टेटमेंट सो नाउ माई एस टी आर इज पॉइंटिंग टू दिस ऑब्जेक्ट हियर मूविंग नेक्स्ट इन द फोर्थ स्टेटमेंट वी आर परफॉर्मिंग सम रिप्लेस ऑपरेशन वेयर आई एम ट्राइंग टू रिप्लेस वर्ड सुरेश All in caps with Suresh Dubey, right? On the STR. And now my STR is pointing to this object. So this object is not having word Suresh, right? So it will not perform replace operation, and there will not be any further modification due to this statement. We executed all my four statements, and after execution, my STR is pointing to this automation Elon all in caps. that is the same output that we are getting in eclipse when we ran it right so that is the reason why we are getting automation elon all in caps and looking at the output it seems like okay concat operation did not work and replace operation did not work so from this diagram we understood two concept first string is immutable so every time we try to perform any modification to the given string it will create a new object like this and my reference variable will point to that newly created object or not that will depend on whether we are storing the output over here or not so like in the second statement we were not storing the output we were not bothering about the modified string but in the third statement i am referring it with the str variable after performing upper case operation so that's why str is pointing to this object so these are the two important concept that we understood today and these two concepts applied behind the scene when we ran this program and we are getting a output as a automation e learn all in caps so now let's modify this program further and we will reapply the concepts that we learned just now and we'll figure out what will be the output then so here what we can do is after performing concat operation let me capture the output in the str variable right so str is the string which has a value as a automation e learn we are performing concat operation we are storing it in the str variable again we are performing upper case operation on the str and again storing it in the str only and here we are not doing any modification and we are printing a str so what will be the output now so let's try to understand this we have a str with automation e learn and then we are performing concat operation so my value will be now automation e learn by suresh right and we are storing the output we are storing the result of this operation in the str so str will point to this now and again we are performing upper case operation to str so my str is this one so it will take this value and it will perform upper case operation and we are storing the result in the str variable right so after this my str value should be automation e learn by suresh right the same value but all will be in caps after that it will perform a replace operation on the str so now my str is this one it will try to search word suresh this one and it will replace it with this so my object will be
this it replace this word with suresh dubey so my object will be this but here we are not storing the output after performing replace operation we are not saving it anywhere right we are not capturing it so new object will get created with this value but it will not point to any reference variable and i am printing str my str is this one so i should be getting automation e learn by suresh all in caps so let's run this and see we are getting the same output that we have figured out right okay if i will use str equal over here so after performing replace operation it will capture the output in str it will have a value as this automation elon by all in caps and then suresh dube right so let's run and see so yes we are getting the same output automation elon by all in caps and after that suresh dube so this is the output that we are getting now that's all i had for today guys and i hope you learn these concepts very well and you can apply these concepts while working on string in java let me know in the comment section if you have any question or any doubt and guys if you are new to the channel please subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends see you soon with a new topic thank you for running this one thank you